Yo, what's good chat? Can everyone hear me okay? I have a super <laughs> jank setup for today. Guys, today we're gonna be doing a Pokemon card opening. And the reason we're doing this is because um, on Tuesday when we play marbles, if you guys finish 25 races playing marbles, uh, you guys get to roll a virtual D100 that I have a Google spreadsheet that corresponds to whatever number that D100 lands on. And so two people got it this last week. What's good, Jacob Joseph? Last week, Kiki got it, in which I couldn't play marbles. That was what she rolled. The second one was Austin rolled a Pokemon card stream. So I just rushed to the store today, and I bought a bunch of Pokemon cards. I have, um, they gave me a little extra little pack right here. And then we have this little ball right here, a little Ultra Ball that I got. It has three packs inside of it. And then I have two battle styles elite trainer boxes that I bought I have not opened this is the newest set and I haven't opened it at all I lost my lo-fi let me let me get that playing again get that a little bit lower yeah right there right there right there right there all right so I'm literally gonna jump straight into it and then afterwards I thought of a good idea there's a few people in my chat right now that want to redeem the end. I know Austin already right now has, I think, enough points to do it twice. And so I haven't even eaten yet. And so what I'm going to do is I am going to uh, stir fry ramen later. And so I'll have to end stream here and then reboot it on my phone in my kitchen. But I'm going to end stream here, reboot it in my kitchen, and start cooking my lunch. And if anyone redeems the end while I'm cooking... I'm gonna put a dab of it into my stir fry ramen. So I already know I'm gonna get at least two of them into my ramen today. So if anyone has enough points, you can go over to do that. All right, with that, and feel free, again, this is a super jank rig. I'm using my phone as a camera for my face and then my other camera here as my other one. And so I think as long as I sit like right here, you know, everything is looking pretty good. I can't do much about the ring light. But again, I'm gonna start with this, with this Rebel Clash one that we got ghetto stream dude i gotta do what i gotta do what's good kiki with the pikachu emo let's go oh my gosh i haven't opened up cards in so long that i am going to struggle to open these things up yeah dude it's a super jank stream i did what i could i threw it together the best i could in the amount of time that i had with only one camera okay this pack literally is not opening there we go it's opening all right I gotta, I gotta open up all these without looking. What's good, everyone that's jumping on in? Alright, we don't care about these. Alright. Three to the front. Let's get straight into it. Let's see, can you guys see all of that okay? It's a little bright, but I think we'll have to... Oh, I almost just revealed all of the cards. We'll have to maybe change the settings. Heracross. Electrode. Applin. I need to get close, that's what I need to do. Bunnelby. I don't expect anything from this pack. This is the random pack they gave me as like for buying from them. Full picks. Phantump. Reverse Hollow is a Nine Tails. That's some really cool art. I like that a lot. And our rare, a Hatturn. Hollow. Not a great start. And then Psychic. Not a not a great first pack, but that's okay. That was kind of our test pack. So now I know. Let's see. Let's see if we can. I have my ring light on currently. If I turn this off, that's too dark. But I think this is what I'm going to have to work with. That's probably what I'm going to have to work with when it comes to, to lighting for this. All right. I'm going to save the elite trainer boxes. And so I'm going to open up this little ultra ball that I got right here. And I only got it. It has three packs inside of it. But I mainly only got it just because I wanted... I wanted the little ultra ball. That's kind of cool. That's not a knife. That's a nail filer. Okay. That's the knife. J 
Chat, how are we doing today? Again, we're doing Pokemon card opening and then we're gonna go do the end hot sauce in my ramen. Oh, there's a little thing I should be using. I'm getting it open. Just kidding. I'm not. I'm using my teeth. I definitely just scratched the ball really bad. Shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. Yo, Jacob, if you're still in here, are you gonna buy the cards that you said you were gonna buy? I still have them. I always forget to uh, remind you. Dude, you had your first vaccine shot? How are you feeling? Is your arm sore? All right, here's the, how do I open this? I'm trying to push on the ball like it's an actual ball. How in the world? Hello? Do you pop off the top? It's not a button. Next time? All right, bet. Dude, what the frick? Dude, I can't get this open. There we go. Oh God, it came with a break point. All right, it came with three packs. The first one, man, these are gonna be in such bad condition because of the way they've been sitting there. The first one is a break point pack, which I'm not super excited for. The second is a sun and moon pack, which is okay. And the third one is a Fates Collide, which I don't know a ton about. My arm is sore, that's about it though. That, yeah, that's how mine was the first shot. <coughs> um, let's go with uh, what I think will be best, or worst to best. So we can work our way up. And we got a little pin, ooh, we got a little Mew. That's cute. All right. We're gonna open up this breakpoint pack. Move that knife out of my way before I accidentally cut myself. Thanks for the alert, Jacob. I appreciate you. All right. Pack has been opened. Three to the front. All right. And again, we got, we're on our second pack and we got 22 more. So we're having a big Pokemon. If I'm gonna do a Pokemon card opening, dude, I'm not gonna like cheap out. Mainly because I don't think I'll, I don't know when the next time I'll actually do one of these will be. All right, let's go. Another trainer. Goodbye. Yeah, I know. I said I'm not going to buy a bunch of Pokemon. What's good, JR? Electabuzz. Pharisee. Esper. I know. I couldn't help myself once I got into the store. Staryu. I was like, I'll spend 100. That's what I'll do. Blitzel. Reverse Hollow is an Aramatus. And the Hollow is a Pangoro. Weak. Weak. Like I said, I'm opening it up from ones that I think will be the best packs to the worst packs. And Battle Styles is like an interesting pack, but there is some good ones. I want that alternate art Tyranitar. My friend Tim got it, but he got an entire booster box and then didn't stream it. I was like, bro, you got mad views the first time you did that. Mad views. Aromatis, uh, whatever. It's a dumb Pokemon. I'm not ashamed to say some of the Pokemon they put out right now is stupid. No, Ray. Ray. It. She wants to come mess with the cards. Yeah, Tim's dumb. All right. Third pack. Lily. Metapod. I don't like the way I'm holding these, sorry. Granbull. Alolan Meowth. Dewpider. Alolan Diglett. Oh, 
crab brawler. The reverse hollow is a Growlithe. I like that. It's cute. And the hollow or the rare is an Arcanine. Okay. And it's hollow. That's kind of cool. What, dude? She wants attention so bad right now. Even though she just got a ton of attention. She's like, the second I turn on my camera, she's like, now I want attention. Before, I kind of wanted attention because you just got home. And then it's like, now that you're live, now I definitely want attention. All right, hooding, moving on to the Fates Collide pack. Okay. These are all in decent condition considering they were st like shoved inside of a ball. All right. Team Rocket's handiwork. Fairy Garden. Brakeson. Solasis. Gothita. Chino and Sino. Whismer. Fennekin. I already have this card. I've opened these packs before. Verse Hollow is an Aerodactyl. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. And the rare is a Kingdra EX. Holy frick, that's a cool card. It's all black. Whoa. Wait. This is legit. How much is this card? A Kingdra EX. The numbers are 122 out of 124. Bro, it's like a $10 card. Let's freaking go. We just opened up like a $10 card. What's good, BG Impact? Dude, we just got like a $10 card. Let's freaking go. Dude, this card's so dope, too. Holy frick. Dude, I like this a lot. I'm gonna move that to the side where it's not gonna be in the way of anything. Where's a safe place? I need to get out my sleeves is what I should have done. That's so dope. I just like the background. It's just, it's... Oh, that's epic. All right. That's all the other little packs. Now we got two Battle Styles Elite Trainer boxes to open. Which are the ones that I'm actually very excited for. All right. The hope is, again, that we get our money's worth for this. And right now... Um, what is it? I think I did the math or it's roughly about $5 a pack. I spent, I spent 117 and we're four packs deep. So $20 in and we already have a car that's worth $10. So we're still, we're still down a bit, but you know, it is what it is. All right. We're going to open up these boxes now. We got two of them. And so in each elite trainer box come with a bunch of stuff for the game. What's the best card you pulled so far? Uh, today or in general? Like ever. The best card I pulled today was was this Kingdra EX. That's the best card I pulled today. Um, the best card that I've pulled ever, it technically wasn't a card that I pulled. I have a, sh a, st uh, well, a store near me that sells a bunch of cards like sports cards, Pokemon cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards magic cards and um they have this thing where it, it's a it's a case and has like 200 different cards in it and uh what they do is they have a bag full of chips with numbers on them and you pay like 20 dollars and you get three pulls i paid for that once and i got so lucky i got the best card in the case and i hope this comes out well um this holographic machamp which uh, right here on the side is a first edition stamp. Now, it, it this comes from the original set. The first ever set that was released in the US, this card is from. So it's it, it, the packs are expensive. They're like $1,000 a piece. Um, they could be worth a lot more. I've honestly have forgotten at this point. But uh, this card probably is only worth like $200, which is still really good. Like I paid, again, I paid 20 bucks. To, to for it pretty much I pay $20 and I'm guaranteed to get like $200 if I just sold it straight up 
Um, I don't have the Rainbow Pikachu. Um, I'm gonna have to keep moving, Ray. Um, but I do have the regular Pikachu V Max right here. No, no Rainbow Pikachu V Max, but the regular Pikachu V Max I do have. But yeah, that's the best card I have. Is the first edition holographic Machamp. All right, let's get into this Elite Trainer box. I'm just going to remove all of the stuff that I don't really care about. I don't play the game. We only open up packs. And so I'm just going to remove the actual packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I guess they only come with eight. Okay, so they come with eight. So we have 16 more packs. Yeah, dude. Dude, I freaking love this clip. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna show the clip on stream. Try and see my face. The way Tim picks me up is terrifying. Alright. I'm gonna get a live scene and we're gonna watch this together. He did this ASMR thing and it was so dumb. C dot. Reverse hollow pine go. Dude, if I saw this correctly, this. Hold on. <laughs> so Tim right here, he grabs me, dude. He just like literally grabs both my shoulders and basically picked me up. I thought I was going to go through my window. <laughs> But that card was the best card in that whole pack. So that was the best card in the whole pack. And he sold it for like straight up $500. Which that card was not worth it, by the way. It, it wasn't in the best condition. But what happened was he put it like PSA 10 question mark, which is what you do on eBay to, for people to be like, what makes a PSA 10? And so some dude on eBay in the middle of the night was like, hey, what makes this card possibly PSA 10? Like, let me see more pictures. And usually when you do that, you wait for the guy to like contact you back to prove that it could be worth PSA 10. You get it graded. It's worth uh, like a thousand dollars, something like that. The guy messages Tim, waits like 10 minutes and then just buys it. So Tim was like, I'll take it. Shipped it to the guy, made 500 bucks. He paid 120 for the box itself. All right. We don't care about all of these things. All right. Let's get into these battle styles, and I haven't opened up any of these yet. I have not opened up any of these packs before. We want the alternate R Tyranitar is what we want. All right. First pack. I'm gonna have to clean up my entire space earlier. Three to the front. Oof. Let's freaking go. All right. Keep more. Bureau. Escape rope. Lick a ton. Horsey. Mankey. Mawile. I need to make sure my arm's a little sure. Fomantis. The reverse hollow is a Cacne. And the hall and the rare is a Steelix. Nice. I like that Steelix card. Running with the double camera now. Yeah, dude, Dino, I'm using my phone. What's freaking good, Dino? I haven't seen you in a minute. How are you doing? <laughs> Dino saw Pokemon cards and he was like, yeah. Dino, I just showed the clip of me, you, and Tim opening up, uh, opening up, uh, Pokemon cards. Have you ever pulled the God Pack? No. What is, what is the God Pack? All right, three to the front. Keep going. I'm gonna keep going. All right. Do I need to change that? It still says Big Brain Lane. 
all the cards are special ones uh i don't think those exist to be honest like because you're gonna have commons like you can't not have commons in a pack which no one likes commons i almost just drop the cards it's freaking upside down <laughs> oh no this is just a misprint card it's just it's placed wrong bro oh i didn't do that what the frick all right Rodant, Gum Pig, Grum Pig, Gligar, or Gligar, Spoink, Bronzer, Tepig, Pacha Risu. The reverse hollow is an EXP share, and the hollow. Oh, is a Cricketone V. Dang, as soon as I saw that full art going on, I was like, holy frick. All right, let's check out how much this one is. Probably not a lot. I don't know anyone that would probably want this card. shopping what the frick you, uh, it's like a $15 it's like 10 to $15 what the frick okay can you guys explain to me why this card right here is more expensive than this card what the frick Dude, sometimes Pokemon makes me mad. The type of things that people will, like, sell out for. That you're just like, why? Why would you buy that? Is it the card is just OP? Once during your turn, you may draw cards until you have three cards in your hand. If this Pokemon is in the active spot, you may draw cards until you have four cards in your hand. Instead, you can't use more than one exciting stage ability each turn. For three energy, flip a coin of heads, this attack does 80 more damage. Okay, so it can do 160, but like, uh, I don't know. It's not like it's like OP, but people, I guess, think it's OP and they want it. It's also probably because it's just the newer set that people are freaking out over it. All right, so it looks like on the low end, we're $20 in. We still got to make back $97 somehow. We gotta make back 97 to for all of this to be somewhat worth it. Alright. Three to the front. Second battle styles pack. Cheryl. Rapid strike energy. BB. Frillish. Esper. Blip bug. Silicobra. Hound door, is it focusing? Sorry about that. Yamper. Uh, oh, this is our reverse hollow. So the rare is a, okay. We can't win every pack. It's fine. So where do I need to put it to actually focus? I need to put it like really close if I need to focus it. Fortunately. Dino, my friend, have you used that awesome Twitch Prime of yours yet? I haven't seen you in a little bit. You could be literally taking money straight out of Jeff Bezos' pocket with that. And wouldn't we all like to take money from Jeff Bezos? Or if you're not going to use it on me, make sure to use it on someone else. Make sure to always use your Twitch Primes if you guys have it. Alright, starting out with Pig Knight. Oop. Scroll of Swirls. 
Boothalant. Cubone. Have you guys heard the theory that everyone thinks now that Cubone is a Charmander? I think it's hard because apparently, because if Charmander's light goes, or it's a Charmander whose mother died in childbirth, and so that's why his tail has never been lit. Remoraid. Ponyard. Houndour. Shinx. First hollow is a heat more. And the rare is a meow stick. All right, we got we're halfway through with this this one box, this one elite trainer box. Again, after this, I'm going to go make some lunch. I'm going to go make some ramen. And whenever you guys redeem the end, I'm going to put a piece of the end into my stir fry ramen and then have to eat it. Homemade spicy noodle challenge. And then if we have any time, uh, I'll do a poll if we want to play marbles or apex. So, which we'll probably end up, we'll probably have an, enough time to play. All right, three to the front. I will need to fix my setup a little bit, but it's chilling. Rapid strike style mustard. More Pekko. Dual Blade. Salandite. Bronzer. Right there. Cacnea. Spoink. Roly Coley. Reverse Hollow is a Mawile. And the rare is a Phalanx. What is with these rares in this? Like, there are sometimes in packs that I see a rare and I'm like, why did they decide to put that Pokemon as a rare card? All right, three more packs in this one. Chat, how we doing? We chilling? Who's hanging out? I know we got Austin in here. I know Jacob Joseph is lurking for us. I think Dino's still in here somewhere. JR, I think you're in here also. I appreciate all you guys being in here. Again, this is because Austin, on Tuesday, while we we're playing marbles, finished 25 races and got to roll our D100 sheet list, and it landed on Pokemon stream. So that's why we open up Pokemon cards. So be there on Tuesdays if you guys want to participate in that kind of stuff. Dotler, fan of waves, dual blade, Tone edge, or C. Mankey. Hey, yo, what's the Pokemon opposite of Thrall? <laughs> Did I know what you're trying to do? <laughs> I know what you're trying to do. Galarian Slowpoke. Thanks for the follow, derp on my slurp. <laughs> Galarian Slowpoke. Pomantis. The reverse hollow is a Murkrow. And the rare is a Cricketune V. So we got the other one. We got the other version, which luckily I already got it pulled up. The one we pulled earlier is worth about 10 to 15. This one looks to be worth about a dollar, then $4. Someone for some reason bought it for 24, $4. So we chilling. Who's Phineas and Ferb's sister again? Bro, what you trying to do? I know all of these. If anyone's on TikTok, they know these things. I'm curious though, how many Finn Ice, he's fine. What's the rarest card I've ever gotten? 
Um, I have this first edition Machamp right here. From the base set. That's the best card I got. Austin, he's chilling. His line, yeah. I, I won't fall for them. Not like last time. I almost fell for Candice a month ago. And yeah, I know I just said it. It's not the same though. The joke is not funny. Um, I'm curious though. Derp, how many, uh, how many streams do you go into? Like, on average, how many people do you get to fall for, for that? Because I know there's a few people on Twitch that just like to go into small streamers and just do those things. But how many people do you actually get? Alright, three to the front. Going to the next pack. Spupa. Gliscor. Bruno, Tepig, Hone Edge, Electabuzz, Baltoy, Wigar, Fan of Waves is our reverse hollow, and our rare is a prime ape, not even hollow. Rip. All right, last pack in this elite trainer box, and then we have another elite trainer box to open up. So we got nine more packs in total to open up today. Can we get a massive pull that makes everything worth it? Well, I just wanted to see people unbox cards, and I remember about uh, yeah. So I want to see if you will fall for it. Fair. Well, I'm opening up nine more packs, so you want to stick around. Also, Pokemon 5 known one is cool. Dude, now I'm like, I'm like scared to read any of your messages for like something that I don't know that you're going to sneak on in there. All right, three to the front. But yeah, we're opening up nine more packs. <laughs> and then I have a hot sauce called the end hot sauce that uh, I'm going to go stir fry some ramen. And when people redeem that channel point in my chat, I'm going to put a piece of it into my ramen. So stick around after the Pokemon cards if you want to see me eat very, very spicy ramen for no reason. And then maybe we'll play some Apex or some Marbles if you ever please seen that before. But I appreciate you jumping in. I appreciate the follow. Let's get in the next pack. Urn of Vitality. Girder. Seedra. Oh, speaking of Seedra, I'll show you another card that I have. I don't know if this will come up too way. Check the Pokemon, please. It's pretty innocent. Nah. Uh, I have this Japanese Hollow Misty Seedra from 1998. Speaking of Seedra, this is my second best card. I'm curious. I'm curious, so I'm going to check it off screen. Among Us. <laughs> that one's funny. Got to be careful out here on Twitch, dog. Onyx. Mawile. Cherubi. Kachirisu. Chimeko. Reverse Hollow is a Phalanx. And the rare. Yo! We got the freaking Urshifu VMAX, dude. Holy frick. That's one of the better cards in the set. Let's freaking go. Sheesh. Dude, let's freaking go, dude. How much is this card worth right now? Dude, that's epic. The, I like this. I like single strike better anyways. Urshifu V Max. Bro. I'm not looking at sold, but it looks like low end somehow someone's trying to sell it for twenty dollars i got the single strike urshifu v max austin 
looking at these prices somehow 20 the lowest but then 65 63 some sort of 130 135 this card alone just made the whole packs worth it holy frick that's so awesome frick yeah dude oh cute <laughs> Dude, that was a great way to end that Elite Trainer box. We got one more to open, chat. Oh. Dude, I think that if anyone's in here and you're just kind of lurking in here and you haven't followed yet, I think that deserves a follow. Pulling a freaking awesome card. I really, really want the Tyranitar invested into more Pokemon cards. Right. All right. There's going to be eight more cards in this pack, or in this box. Dude, I have a whole bunch of trash right here, as you guys can see that. Alright, we're going to ditch all the things that we don't want, because we want to just get straight to the freaking cards, dude. Throw most of the stuff underneath my desk. I'll, I'll deal with it later, dude. After today's stream, I got to leave somewhere, and so... my Myself at, like, one in the morning can come back and deal with this trash. Dude, let's freaking go <laughs> the voice crack let's freaking go dude that's so freaking epic heck yeah can i what ah uh, <laughs> he's fine austin don't ban him He's trying his hardest. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, careful. If you take it too far, my, my mods will will ban you. But I know it's in light humor. I know it's funny. That's why I asked. Because I know some people will just join chats, try and do that, and then leave. That's annoying. You're sticking around, so you're you're different. You're different. You're just trying to have some fun. All right, three cards to the front. I just, I say that to warn you in case you do it in other people's chats. You have to be careful because some people will ban you instantly. <laughs> Angry Burger. Galarian Slowbro. What is my favorite Pokemon? Dude, it's, it's probably Charizard. I, it's super basic, I know. But I have a little, uh, a little Charmander right here. I know it's basic. I know. I really like uh, Raikou. That's another Pokemon that I really, really like. Um, Actually, do I have this next to me? I don't think I do. I don't. I have, I have a, from the Shining Fates packs, I have a, a Shiny Suicune somewhere. I'm just, I'm just now like looking at him like I'm scared to read his messages. That's a cool Pokemon though. Galarian Slowbro. Wait. I thought it was Reverse Hollow for a second. Shut up, Austin. Glorantis. You gotta let memes die. Wait. I just messed up the pack. This was our rare. That's stupid. Favorite generation is generation one. We'll go through these. Trainer, Golbat. I messed up the pack. It was bad anyways. So we're not gonna get anything good. Gen three or bust. All right. I messed that one up, my bad. Good thing that wasn't like really good. It literally was such a bad rare that I was like, oh, this is just an uncommon. That's the bad thing. When certain rares come out and you're like, this isn't the rare. All right. Keep going. All right, three to the front. And I think I might've done it twice by accident. All right. Dotler. 
Dual Blade, Pig Knight, Shanks, Flip Bug, Pawneyard, Mankey, Slizzipede. The Reverse Hollow is a Hound Door, and the Rare is a Victini VMAX Rainbow. Holy frick. Oh, what's good, Chuck? Dude, the luck of Chuck joining in a Rainbow Victini VMAX. Dude, I'm getting, dude, these packs are cracked today. Holy frick. Hold on. How much is this one worth? Victini VMAX Rainbow 165. Yes, it's good. Rainbow is good. It's not amazing because it's Victini. $40, $25, $40, $50, $45, $30, $30. So this card is still by far the best card that we've pulled. But it's still nice to pull a card like this. So Chuck, the way it works is in each set, there are different cards that are worth better prices that people want. And we've been we've been pulling some pretty good cards. Holy frick. Just leave them? I will. I will sleeve them. I'm gonna sleeve them immediately. I, I just don't. All right, I'm pulling decent cards. Let me uh, let me grab my sleeves. That was sparkly. What's good, Haley? <laughs> it was sparkly. It was rainbow. Oh my gosh, all of my mixed sleeves are in here. Holy frick! All right, I'm just going to put these right here. Where were you where were you guys hanging out, Chuck and Haley? What stream were you guys hanging out in? Ow. Ow. I hit my head on my desk twice. Alright, I'm opening up uh these uh top loaders so I can actually protect these cards well. You see me a lot of places. I just sat back down. Oh, you were in Greg's chat? Nice. Oh yeah, I forgot Jedi Greg was just streaming. I was in such a rush today that I didn't even get to check like who who was streaming, who was doing what. How did how did Greg's stream go? Went well? Alright, Victini's going in. Cause it's worth a decent amount. We are going to hard sleeve that up. Alright. And the Urshifu. Let's find another clear one. I'm on lunch for another 17 minutes. Well, you get to watch me open up Pokemon cards for 17 minutes then if you want to stick around. He did a logo today? Oh, that's epic. I'm saving up in his chat with channel points to eventually get a an emote or a logo. I don't know if he does logos for channel points. I know he does emotes. All right. Here's our best two cards. I don't know if you didn't uh, answer or did. I didn't hear. So what's your favorite song? Um, I don't. I'm trying to think. But again, we got we got some pretty good cards so far. Urshifu, Urshifu V Max, Victini V Max Rainbow. That's pretty decent. Uh, my favorite song. Yo, what's good, the Big T? How many boosters have you opened and how many do you have left? So, I bought two Elite Trainer Boxes. Um, and I have opened... I think I had a total of 20 packs. And we currently have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 packs left. So, we've opened up 14. We've opened up 14 so far. We've gotten two pretty good cards. 
So I already got my money's worth. Um, I would answer you what my favorite song is. I'd have to think on it too long. And by the time I start thinking about it again, I'm going to forget. And I got to open up more packs. I got to entertain some people. I'm sorry about that. I like the band 21 Pilots, though. I can give you a band, but I can't give you a specific song. In school, what was your best and worst subjects? My best subject was math, even though I hated it. And my worst subject was English. All right. Moving on to another pack. It's been a bit. Luxio. Durant. Per ugly. Ugly looking Pokemon. Onyx. Spiro. Dude, I hated math. I was just good at it. Slizzipede. Shinx. I'm very logic driven. Kecnea. The reverse hollow is a Bruno trainer, and the rare is a full art Karina's focus. What the frick? Dude, trainers are always 50 50 on if they're worth anything. Let's go, though. I will 100% take that over a different rare. Let's go. Favorite type? I'm assuming you're talking about Pokemon type. Uh, it would probably have to be Psychic. I think it's cool. Karina's Focus 160. Looks pretty sweet. Okay. 27, 25, 40, 40, 44, 40. Dude, we got our freaking money's worth in these packs. We got our freaking money's worth in these packs, guys. I'm going to sleeve this one up also. I would send some of these cards in to get graded. However, with a PSA having their prices upped and also, um, I don't even think they're taking orders right now. Where are my hard sleeves? There we go. Um, they're not even taking orders right now because they have so many backlogs. Like I sent mine in like a year ago. Screw cryptocurrency, just invest in Pokemon cards, right? Can I never ever, huh? Dude, this is sweet. Can I never ever not be... I broke him? Dude, yeah, that sentence broke me. <laughs> I'm also illiterate sometimes. Sometimes I read something and I'm like, what? He broke me too, okay? So <laughs> it wasn't just me. <laughs> the big T, you broke me too. All right, explain, Austin. Again, my worst subject was... Uh, that's like a quad negative. Yeah, using double negative sometimes confusing. How much was it per box? So it was $45 for the Elite Trainer box. So I bought two of those. And then I got a little uh, Pokeball, which is un underneath all my mess. That was like 20. And then it gave me a free pack. So the whole thing together was worth 117. And we easily have gotten past that at this point. At this point, we're close to $200 in our profit. And I still got five packs left just because of this of the freaking urshifu v max that we pulled not that hard to break you that's fair simple sentences i'm just like huh cedra girder fan of waves Galarian Slowpoke, Corefish, Salandite, Roly Coley, Esper, Acherisu, which is, oh, that's the reverse hollow. So the rare is a Jalancent. I don't even know how to say that. That's a stupid Pokemon. <laughs> I'll be real. I might do something like this on a Sunday sometime. This is cool. Dude, poke, opening up Pokemon cards pack is, they're so much fun. They're expensive. They're very expensive to open though. Like again, over $100 I spent. Um, but I'm getting my money's worth. The hard thing is, is you have to know a bit about Pokemon. So watch other streamers. 
watch videos before you go in and buy stuff because you have to know what to buy because certain packs suck and even the best cards suck favorite show um death note and if you don't want anime doctor who I would just ask you there uh, I would say right now the most recent set is battle styles and so I would probably go with that um, but if, if you want to get into Pokemon and there's like I want I want this card like I my favorite Pokemon is this yeah I think you said uh, Mankey is one of your favorites um, I could give you more suggestions after that, but I would say probably just go with Battle Styles because it's the most recent one. That's what I'm doing. And because I haven't opened it before. All right. We got four more packs, including this one. Cacturn. Personally, I think Black Clover story makes up for its animation. Dude, I love Black Clover. I'm caught up with it for the most part. I think I need to go back and catch up. I'm a few episodes behind. Uh, Single Strike Energy. But yes, the story does make up for its animation. I don't hate the animation. Cherubi. I don't even know how to say that. Silicobra. Galarian Mr. Mime. Bell Sprout. Is there a way I can make it to where it's not so freaking bright? Sort of got used to it. Fair. The reverse hollow is a Cacnea. And the rare is a Marowak. I want I want one more good pull. I want one more good pull within these last three packs. That's all I ask for. One more, and I will be satisfied. I'm already pretty satisfied. We've got our money's worth, which is rare for Pokemon cards. To get your money's worth. Unless you buy like an entire booster box. Favorite singer. Uh, probably Tyler Joseph from 21 Pilots. All right, three more, uh, three more, yeah, three more packs. Go bat. Energy recycler. Urn of vitality. Cherubi. Probably neon gravestones for favorite twenty pilot zone. Cherubi, lick a tongue. Elect a buzz. Esper. Timber. Glammeow is our reverse hollow. And going into our rare. Play it all. Alright. Two more packs. Okay. Do you play or only collect? I only collect. I just collect for fun. The only card game I ever play is Magic. That's only when my friends want to play it. Heat more. Biro. Escape rope. But I know how to play the game. Like, I know how to play it. Spoink. Galarian Mr. Mime. Scatterbug. Oh my gosh, that noise freaking scared me. Thank you, Pizza with Anchovies, for following. Why did that scare me so bad? What the frick? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Yamper. Lick a tongue. Reverse hollow is Urn of Vitality. You're good, homie. <laughs> I have I have some too that's super loud. And for some reason, the most like chill one scared me. Alright, the reverse hollow is this, and the rare. Is a Galarian Slowbro. Last pack chat. Again, I am more than satisfied with the cards that we've gotten today. The best three. Karina's Focus. Our Rainbow Victini VMAX. And then one of the best in the set are Single Strike Urshifu, Urshifu 
VMAX. There is a reverse holo in every pack, and then there's a rare. So every pack guarantees has a reverse holo. It's always the second to last card you want to pull. And so the way you pull cards, um, for the most part, when it comes to Pokemon, is when you open it up, there's always this. You want to take it out. Favorite shiny is Charizard because it's epic. And then what you do is you take the top three cards and then you move it to the back. And then this one is always going to be an energy. And then this now this top card is the rare. That's the one that we're waiting to look at. So that's the way you open up your Pokemon cards. Last pack chat. Carnivine. Grumpig. Scroll of Scorn. Tepig. Pachirisu. I don't know how to say that. Ball toy. Favorite sport? None of them. I don't really like sports, to be honest. Galarian, Mr. Mime. Reverse Hollow now is a Murkrow. And the rare. Final Pokemon pack of the stream. Is a Virgifu V Max Rapid Strike. Holy frick. What the frick, dude? <laughs> How did we manage to pull both of them? Holy frick, let me go back. Because I had this already pulled up. Holy frick, holy frick. The rapid strike one. A hundred sixty. Sixty. 97 20 We freaking got our money's worth out of these packs dude. Holy frick. Maybe I'll get back into Pokemon cards Holy frick Guys that's gonna be it for the Pokemon card segment of today's stream. I am more Than freaking happy with everything we pulled holy frick Yes, more Pokemon cards, dude. I know I got excited because it's... Dude, this is like... Okay, so to pull... First off, to pull like any of these three are super rare. Especially one of these two. But to pull both of them is nuts. Holy frick. Alright, chat. We're going to do this. Oh my gosh. Stick around. I know most of you have tons of channel points. And, uh, hold on, let me, uh, I know most of you have channel points and what we're going to do is I am going to go and make myself ramen because I'm hungry, but if you guys redeem the end hot sauce while we're doing our, our sweet little cooking stream, which I already know, I already know Austin's going to do too. I'm going to put dabs of the end into my ramen and we're going to create a spicy ramen noodle challenge at home. I'm going to go check on something. And I will be right back. Alright, sorry I'm back. I do have roommates, so I have to check with them when I do certain things. Check. Thank you for the lurk. I'm gonna get back to work, dude. Thank you so much for jumping in. Thank you for hanging out with Pokemon, even though you don't know too much about it. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. I know I'm out of focus here. I'm gonna end stream here, and then I'm gonna immediately start stream on my phone. Because that's what I have to do to be able to stream in my kitchen. So, stick around. I know there's about eight of you in here. Stick around in here, and we're gonna get to a, uh, a stream. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Before I do that, I am going to uh, make sure to change 
I'm gonna change all the stream tiles so I don't have to do it on my phone. Yeah, really, I do have to do that. It's annoying. It's because I have an app on my phone that lets me go into my kitchen, but because it's connected to my computer, there's a concrete wall between it and it doesn't connect too well and it's super laggy. Okay, change it to end hot, so end hot sauce ramen challenge. And I'm going to end stream here and then reboot on my phone. Stick around. Can you guys see me? Can everyone hear and see me okay? I'm going to uh, boot up my laptop super quick. Oh, I have 9%. Let's get my charger. Yeah, it sucks. I've had to do this before. I don't hate it. Like, it's just annoying that I have to, uh, I have to actually reboot it on my phone. That's kind of annoying. But, all right, sorry, I'm plugging in my MacBook so I can see chat just a little bit better. Yeah, welcome back. It's been so long. Guys, I haven't seen you in so long. I can't wait to get back into streaming. It feels like it's been, like, years, you know? All right. Okay. Hello, kitten. Okay, let me uh, pull up my stream manager on my PC so I can see when you guys redeem things. Because I don't think I can see it on my phone, unfortunately. Favorite cereal brand? <coughs> um, we got a few up here right now. We got the Star Wars Mandalorian. I like Cinnamon Toast Crunch a lot, though. I do like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. All right, bet. Now I can see chat, I can see everything. We're chilling. We're chilling, chat. All right, I got... We're gonna go with, with chicken. We're gonna go with chicken ramen. Aaron says hi. Dude, tell Aaron thank you for following yesterday. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna cook this, my, my chicken ramen. And when you guys redeem it, I'm going to put dabs of the end into my ramen and we're going to recreate a spicy noodle challenge. So Austin, go ahead and redeem it now. Go and do it. I'm going to uh, actually move you guys really quick. I'm going to move you guys over. Sorry about that. There we go. Two end hot sauces. That's what we got. If you guys redeem more, then I'll be doing more. That's a terrible angle. I don't know why I decided to do that. We're gonna, we're gonna try it with that. Even though the lighting is just low-key pretty terrible. Okay. So. And we're gonna be doing stir fry ramen. So if you guys know how to do that, instead of cooking it in a pot, you cook it in a pan, and then you just evaporate all the water out of it. So, what I'll do is I'll cook ramen like normal, and at the very end, when I'm putting in my normal seasonings and stuff, I'll put a little bit, I'll put some dabs of the end in it, stir it around in there. So, hey, don't bite that. cooking stream like everyone wanted everyone's been asking for this cooking stream again i gotta boil this water now imagine if someone uses brush your teeth someone has before someone made me do the end and i had to brush my teeth while still dying it low-key helped so i don't know why i said that because then i could have just told you guys it was bad and you could have redone it but it helped <laughs> And I have milk this time. I've learned from my mistakes that water doesn't freaking help with hot sauce. All right. I gotta, it's a little cold, so I'm gonna have to let this thing dethaw a little bit so it's able to drip out a little bit easier. 
we've got our ramen. And because it's that, I don't really need it to taste that good. I just need to be able to down it. So we're waiting for our water to boil. <coughs> you gave Lane milk and you had water. Yeah, that's how I learned it. Kiki doing another end. Oh, I missed two of them. Kiki had two of them. Now we got four. We gotta do four dabs at the end in our freaking five. Kiki, how many points do you have, Kiki? Hold on. I I'm looking at my uh, request manager to make sure Austin isn't uh, refunding them. I see one, two, three, four, five. Okay, Austin isn't refunding them. I know how to look past these things. I learned from Chuck and Lane stream. I could, but I won't. Yeah. Ch Chuck in his last stream. Sorry, join late. Dude, Keegan, what's up? Keegan, we're recreating a spicy ramen challenge. You joined a little bit late for our uh, I Did Pokemon opening earlier, um, but I'm going to upload the VOD to YouTube. So if you want to watch me opening up Pokemon cards, which we had a few really good freaking polls, you can go check the VOD uh, after the stream. How tall are you? I'm like 5'8". I'm kind of short. I'm like average height. I'm not, af I'm not afraid of my height though. Is this going to be a better angle right here? Oh, that's so much better. That's cap. I'm not 5'2", Austin. You only say that because you're freakishly tall, like 6'4", or whatever, something stupid. I gotta put a little bit of salt in my water. I gotta season my noodles. Austin, I can show you my license. I went on stream, but I'm 5'8". Where's my water? I'll be right back. Dude, my, uh, my whole desk is a mess. Dude, I can't touch the ceiling. What's good, Cthulhu? The cat's giving me the dirty eye. What is she over there? I can't touch the ceiling. Ready? Where do I even set my phone at? See this? This is even lower in my air vent. I can't even reach my air vent. So I need to close it at night to get air in my room. I can't even freaking reach it. Yep, here's Ray. All right, our water's starting to boil. We can drop our ramen in. And then as we're dying, I'll deal with the heat on stream so you guys can see it in full form. Again, five dabs of the end hot sauce. That's what we're working with. Um, and then afterwards, we're gonna take a vote on marbles or apex once I finish dying. We're gonna stream, right now it's 4.09 my time. I'm in Eastern Standard Time. And we're probably gonna stream till about 5.30. Um, I'm trying to think through my day. Yeah, 5.30, roughly. Maybe a little bit past that. I say 5.30 just in case I go to 5.45. Because if we're doing marbles, I gotta finish a Grand Prix, and if we're playing like Apex or something, I wanna make sure I'm actually able to finish those games if we're doing well. My favorite superhero is Spider-Man. Ooh, I forgot I have chopsticks. Yep, my, my favorite superhero is Spider-Man. Always has been since I was a little kid. Haley's yours is, oh, I thought, you, I thought you were about to say Superman. Uh, did he answer what his favorite sport, including eSports? If I include eSports, I like to watch uh, Overwatch. Probably my favorite eSport would be Overwatch. That was, that's a game that I wish I was better at. 
uh, enough to actually play professionally. I love Spider-Man. Might be a bit obsessed, dude. That's totally fine. I love Spider-Man. Again, guys, if you're joining in, and if you like spicy challenges and watching me in pain, um, when we hit 250 followers, which currently we're at 171, um, I am going to be uh, doing the Buffalo Wild Wings Blazing Wings Challenge. Whenever we win, or whenever we get to 250 followers. I have a sub goal that's going um, for 25 subs. If we get to 25 active subs, I will take it from 250 to 200. So then the Blazing Wings Challenge will come even sooner. Keegan, I love Venom Awesome. I do not read the comics, unfortunately. You're actually wearing a Spider-Man shirt today? That's cute. <laughs> Alright, our ramen is starting to cook. Gotta let it start stir frying soon. Yeah, I'm wearing a shirt that says Apocalypse today. Cthulhu, you like Wolverine? Yeah, what's everyone's favorite superhero? Mine's Spider Man, Haley's is Spider Man, Cthulhu seems to like Wolverine. The big team, my favorite would probably be Hulk. So I do really enjoy the live action Daredevil series on Netflix, same with Jessica Jones. I've tried to watch those, but I know they have like a pretty good loyal fan base. Yeah, Keegan, you like Venom? Hulk is a good one. Hulk is like a rare one. Like I do know some people that like their favorite superhero is Hulk, and there's no hate on that. So don't mis mishear me. But I don't meet too many people that are like, Hulk is my favorite. Like Spider-Man people run you run into all the time. Like Spider-Man, Superman, Batman, like there's Captain America, like or Iron Man, like they're super common. So respect for you for having something different. Spider-Man is a version of Peter Parker who is made up of spiders. Spiders, man. And was that what I said? Yeah, dude, I, I can't speak. I suck at reading and uh, I suck at speaking, which is funny that I'm trying to be a streamer because I, I can't freaking talk ever. I might have put a little bit too much water in here, but we'll figure it out. Actually, no, I think I put enough. All right, we're dropping in our uh, chicken now. We love Brendan in spite of his illiteracy. Thank you. I have a list which has S on it, which is why it's ironic. Alright, stirring in this chicken bits, water starting to come out, alright, it's time to start adding this, uh, this junk. I'm going to put it on a spoon to make it easy, and I'm going to put five dabs on it, so I'm going to, I'm going to do it separately to make it easier in my head but I'm going to uh, do it five times. Wolverine was a loner, and no matter how much pain he was in or how much crap the world threw at him, he kept getting back up. I'm a big fan of the Tormented Heroes. That's why, like, in Star Wars, my favorite is Obi-Wan. My man goes through so much crap and, like, still comes out a good guy. All right. I think what I'm going to have to do is use my chopstick and get five little dabs out. So there's one. There's two. That was a lot. There's three. Oh my god, I smell it. <coughs> Four. And five. Holy frick, that's a lot. <coughs> that smells terrible. <coughs> yeah, there's definitely a lot in that. That's gonna hurt. Is I'm still cooking, so if anyone has any other last minute end hot sauces, you can use it. 
I'm going to double check and make sure that there was five. One, two, three, four, five. There was five. <coughs> Obi-Wan lost everything and kept walking the good line he did. Saddest death that made you cry? Uh, I don't know. I don't really cry at a lot of things. Oh my gosh, it's starting to change the color of the freaking broth now. I'm going to show you guys this, and it's not going to look like it's in the ramen, but it definitely is. I can smell it. What's good, sissy is beast? Why is it cooking with mace again? Because content. Because there's nine of you in here. Ten of you, depending on what screen I look at, that want to see me in pain, apparently. So, content. Ugh. Yeah, like, look, it doesn't look like it's in it, but if you know, it's a little, like, orange. So, at 2.7, I'm going to try and grab today. Dude, do it. It doesn't look like it's in there, it's definitely freaking in there. <sighs> Alright, we're almost ready to plate this. Any last second end hot sauces? Because Kiki and Austin just dumped all of their points. Jeez, dude. You made me want ramen again. Haven't had that in years. Dude, heck yeah, dude. I have so much ramen in my freaking um, cabinet. It's just like easy. It's like the easiest thing to cook. And I don't really know how to cook, so. Again, if you guys like watching spicy stuff, when we hit 250 followers on this channel, we're going to be doing the uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. Uh... Blazing Wings Challenge, which is their hottest hot sauce. It's 12 wings, 5 minutes, no water, no milk, no anything. Just you and your wings. You need to finish it in 5 minutes. It's the hottest hot sauce they have. So, we're currently at 171 followers. When we hit 250 followers, we're going to be doing that. Or, if we hit our sub goal of 25 current subs, I will make that 200 followers instead of 250. Almost ready. It's stupid easy to make. It was the only thing I could make for a long time. Yeah, fair. It's the only thing I like made in like when I was in my dorm at college. Just because it was like, you would get home and I was like, I want to do nothing but sleep, but I have to like kind of consume things or I'm going to die. All right, you guys probably got like 30 seconds left if anyone wants to use the end hot sauce. Because this thing is coming out about ready. You got some Pepto handy? No, I'm fine. Sweet or spicy? Super spicy. I do enjoy spicy things. I don't really like sweet things, to be honest. I like savory things. All right, the ramen's pretty much done. All right. I'm putting the lid on this thing. No more in. Uh. All right, there are currently five dabs of this thing in this freaking ramen. Yeah. 
Alright. Oh, dude, I'm not excited for this. This is gonna freaking hurt. Especially because it's like there's no broth, so it's just all inside the ramen. Favorite type of food, like Mexican or Chinese? I love Chinese food. I love Japanese food, also. Like sushi and ramen and hibachi. I love that kind of stuff. Holy frick, I'm not excited. Here, we're actually going to sit down at my table. Sorry, I keep moving you guys. Ugh. Even the cat looks concerned. Dude, I, want, I don't want Ray anywhere near this food. All right. I'm waiting for it to cool off a little bit. So I'm gonna get my cup of milk out. I almost just instinctively licked my hand. Holy frick, I can smell it. Is this the new way we do the end hot sauce challenge? I'm getting milk. I think we're ready. Uh, put Ray back. We need Ray's reaction. Uh, I'm sure that would teach Ray a fast lesson of not to eat my food. Yes. She's already coming over here. She smells it. You want to come smell this? I'm not going to let you lick it because you'll die, probably. My worst fear, damn, we're really gonna go there. My worst fear is that I do nothing in my life that is uh, meaningful or impactful to people. Also, since we were talking about anime earlier, I got my Full Metal Alchemist mug. I'm waiting for it to cool off. We're gonna try and see how much of this I can finish without drinking milk. Be nice to her, she's cute. She doesn't dare to be bullied. I'm making sure she doesn't die. She's sitting perfectly off camera. We who are about to die salute you. I don't have a salute emote yet, but I think it's ready to eat. Oh God. It's time boys. What anime uh, world would you want to live in? Probably Naruto. Does Clone Wars count as an anime? If so, definitely Clone Wars. All right, three, two, one. Oh, oh yeah, it's definitely in there. Hey, that's my milk. It's animated, that's true. Oh, it's very much in there. And it being hot doesn't help, it makes it worse. Drink all his milk, Ray. You're sending in the troops to get rid of my milk. dude it's called strategy I'm trying to see how far I can go without drinking milk 
It's called strategy. Sending in cats to get rid of my milk. Dude, the way it, because it is still like really like temperature wise hot. And so it's making my tongue more sensitive. And then the heat, and there's a lot of it in here too. I put freaking five dabs of it in here. All right, I have to go for milk. I have to. Yeah, dude, it hit like a truck. Because I think it's like warmed up. Yeah, it's six million Scoville units, that's why. If you've ever watched the uh, Hot Ones, I always compare it to this. If you've seen Hot Ones, which a lot of people have seen, the last dab is their hottest hot sauce. That's 2.2. My hot sauce is six times, sorry, three times hotter. Ow. That's on my lips. Yeah, watch that clip if you want to see me do it for the first time. I've built up a tolerance for it, which is why people spam it, which is why there's five in that video, I did that. I did one dab. There's five in this. Five across this ramen. And it's very potent. It hurts everybody. Sword of Berserk would be proud of you. I would have died by now. I have zero tolerance. And I hope he's proud of me. <laughs> That is the best clip for my channel. When I read anime, I think of animations as cartoons purely from Asia. If people mention animations, I think of animations globally. Fair? Yeah. I would leave it Naruto if, you're, if you don't count Clone Wars as an anime. Ow. You see how hot or freaking red my face is? Dude, every single time I take a bite, it's like a piercing pain on my tongue. What did I tune into? Sarita, you turned into me doing the end hot sauce ramen challenge. That bite wasn't that bad. Mm. That bite was. I don't think it spread evenly. Even though I kept stirring it. We're like halfway through this. I heard it hurt my stomach. Sword art would be. Dear God. Strawberry donut. Ugh. My body is literally telling me, stop, stop, stop. That's a legit tear. Y'all, oh, you see that? Oh. Thanks, Keegan. 
Maybe three more big bites. Nope. No. Ow, that one hurt a lot. Any more milk? Ugh. Holy frick. Dude, this is so much worse than just doing it normally. We got like maybe three to four more bites left and my body when i pick it up literally is like flinching to be like stop 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 uh. and because it's like it feels so much harder because when i do it normally it's on a chip and i just throw it in and that's it that's all it is. This time it's like I have to painfully go through each bite. Oh. Oh, holy frick. Austin, was this worth it? I ban you from stopping. I'm not going to stop. All right. So, this is how I'm going to do the band from stopping. There's that much left. When I take my next bite, I'm going to power through the rest of it. Just go through all of it. Let me get it all to one side. I'm about to like Naruto this junk, dude. I know what you redeemed. I'll catch you later. All right, let's freaking go. I did it. Holy frick. Dude, I'm impressed too. That one really freaking sucked. Oh. down it still hurts I finished the food but it's not over I missed it no dude I'll uh you can always watch the VOD or I upload my VODs to YouTube if you do exclamation point YouTube I have a VOD channel Serena thank you for the 100 bits I have a YouTube VOD channel that I'll upload this to so you can watch it. So you can still relive it. All right. There is still like an hour left in my stream. You did it at what cost? I'm out of freaking hot sauce. Or not hot sauce, milk. I'm gonna try and push through this. I'm gonna create a poll. Hey, don't drink my milk. Cthulhu, thank you for the 25 bits, my man. I'm gonna add a poll that whenever I go back to my PC, it hurts so much. Ow. Are we gonna play marbles or apex? Oops. All right, it's starting to die down, I think. 
All right, vote on what you guys want, marbles or Apex, whenever you go back to my PC. Ugh. Chat, it hurts us so much. I think we know now that if you guys want me to do the end, we do it in ramen style because it's so much worse. So much worse than the chip. You don't look good, dude. I don't feel good. I'll be okay. I'm good now that you guys sent in some bits. That makes me feel better. Thank you again, Serena and Cthulhu. Famous last words, I just die. Ugh. Whew. All right, pull's ending. Is it tied? <laughs> oh my gosh, it tied. Uh-oh, what's good, foo on, dude? I see spicy talk. All right, we're gonna do it again. Marbles or Apex? We can't we can't leave on a tie. It missed the vote. Well, there you go. I'm redoing it because it tied. Did the hot sauce happen? Yes. Who wanna upload the vod on YouTube so you can watch it on YouTube uh, whenever that goes up. Check out my uh, YouTube channels. Why'd I do Z? What the frick was I doing? The first link is my main channel. The second link is my VOD channel. And the third link is my clip channel. I'm going to upload that to the second link, the clip channel. Didn't know how to vote? We'll vote now. You just click on it and vote. It's still going. Ugh. Man, that hurt a lot. Holy frick. All right, what is it? Eight votes on marbles. Sissy's Beast contributing 100 channel points. Won't let you vote. I'm sorry. Well, eight people voted for marbles, so. Looks like we're playing marbles. All right. Let's, uh, let's clean up all this junk real quick. I'm going to drink some water. I don't know if that'll help. It's starting to go away. And then uh, we'll end stream here um, so I can switch back over to my PC and we'll boot up some marbles and we'll, we'll do some Grand Prix for the next 45 minutes or so, which is uh, I think time for about three. So you guys can try and get, oh, for those of you that are just joining the first time, when we do marbles, this is how it works. I need to blow my nose. This is going to be gross for you guys. When we do marbles, we do this. If you win a Grand Prix, which is five races, you get... Uh, a VIP coin flip, no matter if you're just now following as of today. That was gross. Oh. And if you're already VIP, then um, you get to reduce channel points for 10% if you win the Grand Prix. Or um, if you do a coin flip as a VIP, you get to reduce it by 25%. Okay, we're back. So I'm going to uh, end stream here for a second, and I'm going to reboot it on my computer. All right, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, you guys are gonna watch this on live. I'm gonna fix a few of my normal technical stuff, um, and we'll get we'll get into it. Ugh. I gotta refocus my camera really quick. If I win, uh, can I give VIP to someone? Yes, you can. You are allowed to do that. Have to go. All right, see you later, Keegan. Bravo for keeping it going. I would have been in the fetal position begging for madness to escape from the burning. Ugh. It'd be like that sometimes, dude. All right, uh, where is my camera? Sorry. Which camera you got? Uh, I have some random Logitech one. I honestly don't know the name of it. I'm sorry. 
It's not one of the better ones though. I bought it online. All right, the focus. There we go. There we go. All right, our camera is refocused. If I win, can I take someone else's VIP away and said, no, you can't, Fuhan. Well, I didn't, oh my gosh, I forgot to click save. Ah. Here we go. Okay. Okay. I gotta move all my freaking Pokemon card trash now. All right. Ah. Uh, it's a webcam. It's okay. Yeah. Alrighty. We're not gonna be doing stream raiders. And we'll be doing some, uh, just chill, chill. Chill stuff. Yeti Mike. Woo! Alright, let me boot up marbles. Again, if you guys win a Grand Prix, you guys get. Uh, VIP coin flip and if you uh, are already VIP and you win you can either give someone VIP you can reduce channel points or do a coin flip to reduce more channel points and usually what we would do is if you race 25 races you get to uh, do a D100 um, and with with the corresponding list of things whatever that lands on I have to do some effect chat some effect me some effect the stream um, we won't have time for 25 races. I can tell you that right now. Thank you guys again for everyone that's hanging out. I'm still recovering a little bit. It's hard having the thickness of the Robin with the residues of the freaking... <sighs> we're gonna be listening to Lo-Fi for the rest of the stream. And we're just gonna... We're gonna chill out. All right, how was the ramen? The ramen tasted pretty good. It just hurt a lot. <coughs> All right, let me sign into Twitch. All right, we're all set there. Hello, Ray. Thank you guys for bearing with me on all my technical difficulties on certain things. Let's uh, let's get right into it. All right, Grand Prix, five races. One, two, three, four, five. We don't want Portal Purgatory, that one sucks. All right, you guys know how it goes. Ray, you can't drink my water. You have your own water. Exclamation point play, get your marbles in. Five races, win the Grand Prix. Oh. I didn't know it was on 10 seconds. I forgot it was. Sorry about that, I'm gonna redo that. Bad streamer mode. All right, I'm gonna change it to 45 seconds. Fool. I know. Shit. All right, 45 seconds. All right, you guys have 45 seconds to join in. Unsubbed. <laughs> Unsubbed, I'm un unmod me. Ah. Uh. Yeah, get your marbles in next page when we play. Even if you're newer to the channel, you could still win VIP today. Oh, we're still recovering. Dude, that ramen's gonna hurt coming out later. Fuhan is mod. I modded Fuhan and I modded Chuck. Uh. We got me, Austin, Haley, Sarita, Derp, Fuhan, Big T, and Kiki. I think I said everyone. I don't know if I repeat everyone. But isn't Hag a better mod than Fuhan? I don't think Hag ever joins. Or, uh, she does. She joined once. I'll make sure to abuse my power like the best of them. Yeah, yeah, that's all my mods abuse their power. Don't let her hear that. <laughs> Ugh. Ow, it's, I breathed it in. So Austin, was that, was that 
finally worth it. I know you've been waiting for me to be in a, as much pain as I was the first time. So we'll do that. We'll, uh... So what we do typically chat, it was, you did well though, I'm impressed. Yeah, I, I did so, I don't know how I did that. I've just done it so many times. On Tuesdays, um, we have Marble Stream guaranteed. Um, for about a few hours. Um, and on Thursdays, what I like to do is, uh, do a vote stream. So chat gets to vote on what we play. It's been marbles every week, which I'm totally fine with. Um, but I'll throw that in the mix that, uh, we can do like, uh, between marbles, apex and, and hot sauce ramen challenge. Sarita taken first. So that way, if people have the end hot sauce saved up, I go make ramen, and people can spam that. Like, Kiki had enough for three end hot sauces, which is nuts. Definite went off map. Kiki RIP. Kiki died. It's okay, Kiki got her amusement from the stream, freaking spamming the end hot sauce three times. <laughs> that, that was... 12,000 points that she just used. That's nuts. Uh, yeah, I kind of made her do it. <laughs> That's fine. I don't care. Probably payback from the hot sauce. Yeah, yeah. Yep, this is uh, all rigged. It's all pre recorded. I planned it where Kiki would die because I'm mad at her for the end hot sauce. Good job, Sarita. Sweet Sarita. I know she said earlier, if I win, can I give it to someone else? Yes, you can, Sarita. Forty-five seconds. Get your marbles in. Thank you guys again for everyone that's hanging out. Uh today's been a good stream. Pulled some very good Pokemon cards. As much as the end hot sauce puts me in pain, it's really fun. Uh, cause a lot of people like to join when I'm doing the end and it's a good, I like to be able to engage with people. Thank you again for the bits. Thank you for the follows. Uh, welcome back C sissy. <sighs> I'm sorry if I'm quiet, I'm still recovering. I may need to get some caffeine on the way to the thing I gotta go to tonight. Favorite pizza topping is more cheese. Lurking around mainly here though, you're all good. You're totally fine. Uh, you are totally fine. I appreciate you even being here. Dude, you're a sinner. Pineapple doesn't go in pizza. JK pepperoni. Okay, that's fair. Never mind. You're a saint. Lurking all my fellow small peoples. We appreciate you. Us small streamers definitely appreciate lurks. I lurk in a lot of people's streams. Oh, no, Haley. No. Dude, Turbo my slurp with the Carl Weezer profile picture. You gotta love it. <laughs> Eat. <sighs> my stomach is so heavy. I do put pineapple on my pizza. It's not my favorite though. If it's not your favorite, just don't put it on your pizza then. Easy. I'm I'm all for unnormalizing pineapple on pizza. I love pineapple and I love pizza. Dude, but warm warm fruit for the most part freaks me out. It's like warm pineapple with cheese and tomato sauce. Nah. No. It's different when it's like in a pie though. You know? Like a, a good apple pie. 
What's your least favorite veggie cauliflower? Red junk's stupid. It's just like a knockoff bad broccoli. <laughs> this is the this is a, I, this is getting into very controversial ground for me. I try and keep this stream as clean as possible for the most part. For like myself, I don't care what chat says for the most part. I I, I try not to be controversial, but I I have to take a stand against pineapple on pizza. It's stupid. I like cauliflower, but your description is spot on. It's dude, it's just bad knockoff broccoli. Don't the names normally display above the marbles? Uh. Yes, sorry. I I needed to press Alt. <coughs> I think explain math on a test is stupid. Oh yeah, like uh, when you're in school and you're taking a math test and you get the right answer, but your teacher's like, "But you didn't show the work correctly." It's like, shut up. Like I tried. Like my sister's only three years below me and I literally tried to tutor her in math once and she almost failed the test because she got the right answers but the method that I was showing her was wrong apparently but it's the way I learned it and I'm like why did you change it I used to wrestle we would always worry about cauliflower ear Ooh. Sorry, chat is flying right now, so I don't like the form of cauliflower. Most teachers I had uh, want to sh you to show your work because uh, they'll give partial credit, but I agree sometimes. But I think, like, depending, like, they shouldn't take points off if you're getting the right answers, but you're using a different method. That's stupid. I do enjoy pineapple. Uh, that's why I put it on my pizza. Same with uh, minced meat and ham, though I don't require all of them on every pizza on, like, pepperoni. Pepperoni is almost a requirement. Same with bell pepper. I don't know about that one. I was with you until you said bell pepper also. I don't hate bell pepper. But I wouldn't put it up there with pepperoni. <sighs> Dude, welcome in, Chuck. Oh, frick. It looked like you were about to make it for a second, sissy. <laughs> Everyone coming in behind. Chuck, gotta get his first double today. Rack, rack, rack currently holds the record for us on this one. Olives? Dude, I need to stop talking about this only because I, I'm I'm someone who literally will just get cheese and pepperoni. So if you say other things, I'll be like, Ugh. I mean, early in here, we had pizza with anchovies. Literally someone's name on Twitch. One of Fuhan's real good friends. Oh no, Chuck. No, Chuck, no! You're stuck! No! Dude, that's such... No! Sissy is beast stealing it. Derp in second. Cthulhu. The Big T. Chuck. Sarita. Fuhan. Austin's dead. And I get in. Last place. Rigged. Would you ever skydive or have you already? I have not skydived before and I would love to skydive. SOB pizza? Huh? Take that, nerd, and I died. Yes! <laughs> I can't deal with pure meat pizzas. I need non meat ingredients besides tomato sauce and cheese, so I often choose bell pepper fare. I do like a meat lover's pizza, but like, it's not always my go-to. Like if someone orders meat lovers, like I'll have a slice or two, but like I myself will never order a meat lover's pizza. How do you feel about stuffed crust? Dude, I freaking love stuffed crust. Sir Bubba, welcome to the stream. Thank you for jumping on in. I refuse to put vegetables on my pizza. Fair. Sausage, onion, bacon, and the tomato sauce is replaced with barbecue sauce. SOB. Gotcha. Sausage, onion, and bacon. That sounds good. Meat lovers is too much. I yeah. I don't I don't disagree with you. I need to move my chat box. I just not realize that. Um 
I think thin crust is okay. I don't like thin crust. I like I like having my crust. You know? You know? Where do we want this? Yeah, where do we want this? Is that is that two is that two in the middle of the screen? There's so much happening that I just don't know where to put it. I enjoy blue cheese and stuff. I like dipping my crust and stuff. We're just gonna put it in the corner. Uh, there is a way for you to change your marbles look. The way you have to do it is I'm pretty sure you have to download marbles on your computer and uh, sign into your account and change it off of that. Um, I could be wrong. Thank you for the follow, sir, Bubba. I appreciate you. Um, to someone that had like sissy, I know you do. How do you change it? Because I'm used to changing it as a streamer. Although I did have pepperoni pizza with jalapenos on it the other day. That sounds kind of good. There's a marbles on stream app. Okay, so download an app on your phone and you can change it. I also like a thin crust pizza with garlic parm sauce, bacon, and feta cheese. Do you guys, do you guys have a... Uh... What is it called? Uh, Florida friends, Austin, what is the pizza place? Um, there's one in like Winter Park, uh, where it's like you build your own pizza. Do you know what I'm talking about? If Dino was in here, you'd know instantly it's his favorite place. <clears throat> I don't like PBJ because it, uh, either too much jelly or too much peanut butter. Dude, I love peanut butter and jelly, and I love to put way too much peanut butter and way too much jelly on it. Just log in with Twitch and you can buy modifiers, skins, and other things? Heck yeah. I put peanut butter and jelly on my hamburgers. What? I've never heard of that. Blaze Pizza. Does anyone else have Blaze Pizza near them? Where you get to build your own pizzas? I love Blaze Pizza. Thank you, Austin. Blaze is great. All right, so Fuan, you have it also? We have it in Chicago. Heck yeah, you guys have Blaze Pizza, dude. I freaking love Blaze Pizza. My old roommate, Dino, was obsessed with Blaze. Like, wanted it like every single day. And he went on keto, and it made it worse because they had a keto pizza. And so it made him even more obsessed, and he wanted to go like every day. He, 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 made, he had to literally tell himself, I will only get Blaze Pizza on Sundays to limit himself. Not that I know I'm in Pensacola. I think it's nationwide. It's the chain that LeBron owns. Really? LeBron owns? I did not know that. They are very good value for the size that you get. Uh, what weird food combination do you like? I don't know if I like any weird food combinations, to be honest with you. Like, I'm not a picky eater, but I'm a very basic eater. Like, I don't really push past my limits. You ever been to Hooters? Yeah, I've been to Hooters. French fries dipped in vanilla milkshake. Dude, that's not weird. That's so normal. Dude, Chuck, was it you that asked me yesterday? Someone asked me yesterday in chat. Yeah, it was you. Uh, what the best... Milkshake is to dip your fries in. <laughs> How about a slice of cheese on a apple pie? What the frick? That wasn't you? Chuck, someone literally asked me, what is your favorite milkshake to dip fries in? That's funny that you said that. Dude, fries and Frosty. I would only go to Wendy's sometimes as a kid just to get fries and put in my Frosty. Mobile is the closest to me. Banned. Yeah, <laughs> Fuan's banned. <laughs> Dude, my mods are fighting. Yeah, people do that's pretty good. What? A slice of cheese on apple pie? I don't like that. Wendy's always reminds me of the finger chili. Dude, their chili's pretty good, not gonna lie. Streamlabs really wanted that in chat. I hate cake, but I like cupcakes. Same. Uh, I like both. I don't really like sweets. 
Sharp cheddar cheese with grapes. What the frick? I respect that also, Dirt. Hold on. Sharp cheddar with grapes. Apple pie without apples, yeah. <laughs> apple pie without the apples and just cheese. It's called having a refined palate. <laughs> no, your palate is just stupid. I think my palate's normal. I like normal people food. This email makes more sense now. <laughs> Angry burger. Not everything is Kool-Aid and Dino Nuggies. Did I love Dino Nuggies? Cheese pie then. Yep, it would just be cheese pie. Dude, I think this is the biggest, one of the bigger marble streams we've had. I appreciate you guys all staying in here. I got about 30-ish uh, minutes left. So... When it hits around 520, we'll, we'll start wrapping up whatever Grand Prix that we're on. We'll find someone to raid. Oh, oh my stomach is still slightly recovering. It's gonna- dude. I don't care if it's TMI. Dude, it's gonna hurt coming out the other end later. It's gonna hurt. Poached eggs over corned beef and hash patties. That actually sounds good. That actually does sound good. With hot sauce on them? Yeah. Dragon going in, rocket coming out. Facts. A very uh, blown up rocket. Sometimes uh, I have to go to the bathroom like straight up five times because it doesn't come out all at once. I want an instant coffee into an instant ramen wasn't actually was actually not bad coffee ramen yeah chuck that doesn't sound bad that sounds great to be honest just sounds like a good like breakfast sandwich in a way Haley page taken first oh we're already done let's freaking go and third place we got derp on my slurp. Second place is Sweet Sarita. And in first place is Sissy is Beast. Let's go, Sissy. All right, you're already a VIP. And so, Sissy, I think you know the breakdown, but here are your three options. Gift a VIP to someone. Reduce a channel point by 10%. Or you get to do a coin toss. And if you win, you get to discount a channel point by 25%. I make my sandwich as the following two bread, toasted egg, fried bacon, cheese, then ham, then lettuce, then hot sauce. Nice. Oh. Hot sauce is going down. All right. Do you want it to go down by 10% or do you want it? Do you want a coin flip for 25? Ten percent or coin flip. While you're typing that in chat, I'm going to start up the next one. Since we only got so much time today. You said I'm feeling lucky. You want heads? Alright. Uh, what did I just do? What the frick did I just do? Alright. Let's flip this coin. She wants heads. She's feeling lucky, dude. The end hot sauce is going down by 25%. I will do all of this post stream just to let you know. Just to make it easier on myself. All right, five more races. Before, Sissy was like, I'll take down like hydrate or like posture check to like take care of you. And now she's like, death, the end, go. All right, five more races. I'm going to put it in my notes so I don't forget, by the way. Get your marbles in. Alright. 
We're chilling. We're chilling. Now it did get spammed five times, so it will go up just to let you know post stream. But what Sissy did is she made it where it won't go up as much. So pretty much Austin's were free in a way than it going up. I have a way that I do my channel points and it's super annoying, but I understand it. And Austin, my mod understands it. So he knows I'm not cheating it. Sorry, I'm losing chat. Wow, the Marvel app says bad. <laughs> it's the emoji with it. Wow, the Marvel app is bad. I bet it led us to the next level. I'm off. Have a great evening slash night. Thanks for streaming. Dude, thank you for jumping in the big T. I appreciate you. Thank you for hanging out. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Yo, what is good, King Michael? Welcome back to the stream. What is good, Mikey Check? Mikaya Check? I'm sorry if I'm saying your name. I'm illiterate. Correct me, please. Thank you for jumping in the stream. What's the most dangerous thing I've done? Uh... I'm glad people don't ask me these questions when I'm streaming. I'm surprised I'm doing good with it. Mike, I got you. Thank you for joining in, Mike. Um... Yeah, Derp and my Slurp has just had some good questions. Um... Bro. Um, probably just move to Australia. There's a lot of spiders there. Very good chance of dying. Chuck, you would have to censor yourself if people asked you questions. It wants me to let it access my Twitch, but it has no buttons visible to let me do it. That's annoying. That's a crappy app. Confirmed. Asking questions in stream. Uh, going to try it on PC instead of phone. Yeah, do that. It's on Steam. If you just download this on Steam and sign in. R.I.P. Austin. Uh, you can change your marble. Should be a big button that says log in. No, I just think people would be terrified by my answers. Probably. I won't lie to you. I think I know you decently well compared to most of my other streamer friends and, uh, probably. Example one time because I I hot hit in I got hit in the mouth. Yo, Fuhan pie so re subbing with a tier one. Thank you, Fuhan. I Appreciate you Everyone Sorry back to what you were saying this dude join the club. <laughs> Thanks Fuhan uh, One time because I got hit in the mouth by the trucks of a skateboard I had to use a razor to cut my gums open and pull out pieces of my broken teeth What the frick? Why didn't you go to an ER? Chuck. <laughs> Chuck. <laughs> what? <laughs> Austin's right. I need more Chuck stories. <laughs> Dude, what would you rather do? Walk on glass and nails that are super sharp? Or step on your cat's tail? Walk on glass. Dude, I don't want to hurt my cat. My cat's sweet. Sorry if I missed your chat message. If I missed your chat message and it's been a little bit, uh, you can go ahead and repeat it. If you really want me to see it. It's the look at the camera for me. <laughs> <I'm> a... <laughs> I didn't have health insurance. Fair. Well, you're alive, which means it worked. Do you still have, uh, like, pain in your mouth? He lives on the edge. Chuck hit himself with a skateboard on purpose just so he could do it. F your cat. I feel so bad if I step on my cat even if it's by accident. Facts. No, it's all healed up now. That's good. This was years ago. I, still though, you took a razor blade to your mouth. Like that, you could permanently jack something up. Did you ever get punched in the mouth by John Cena, Chuck? For context, Chuck knew he used to know John Cena. That's why I can ask that. He used to play ping pong with him in his mom's basement. Plenty of times. 
Bro, you could have ended yourself doing that or gotten an infection that would require having your jaw removed. Yeah. That's freaking nuts. Once again, thank you guys, all of you guys that are hanging out. Thank you so much. But then we wouldn't have these rates. Yeah, yeah, See, it works out now because now Chuck has channel points on his on his stream where we get story time with Mikey. And so we can't hear stories like this. Madman, I approve. <laughs> Yo, I'm looking down. Dude, we just hit 2k views on this Twitch channel. Let's freaking go. <laughs> Careful, he threatened to murder me for calling him Mikey last night. There's a reason. It's short story time with Mikey Knuckles and not story time with Chuck. Oh, yeah. I want story time with Mikey Knuckles. Story from the 6th grade, me and my friend were cleaning cause mess and recycling paper in a garbage bin that's huge so we had this idea of throwing me into it so he threw me and a teacher saw me go into it uh, and had to help me get out and when she said what happened I said I fell in. Nice. Well, look it out for a homie, not calling him out. I mainly approve because those are the actions that land people at my work. Cthulhu, are you, do you work in the ER? Do you work at the doctor's office? What do you do? Do you work at a hospital? Bro, uh, what was it? My friends and I, when we were in like middle school, tried to create an Instagram account that was like knockoff jackass. And our only video, which got deleted, which sucks, was just my friend putting a trash can over his head. And then my other friend ran at him full speed and just rammed into him. We gave him a concussion. Our only video, and then we're like, we probably should stop doing this. We posted it and then they ended up taking it down because he was like, I don't want people to see me cry. Thanks to the saying, watch this, I will always have a job. I work in a surgery center. Nice. Oh, frick, I died. Guys, for our friends that are just jumping on in here, uh, that's somewhat new to the channel, we have a Discord channel that you should definitely jump into. I love to be able to engage and hang out with you guys. Um, so do exclamation point Discord, and I would love to have you in our Discord. Do you give discounts? <laughs> it's amazing how many BBs we pull out of people, like from BB guns. Speaking of doing dumb things, I got thrown from the roof of a car once and ended up in the hospital for three days. What the frick? Thank you, Fuhan and Sissy, for the for the Discord links. Like, if I get bulk, <laughs> if I get bulk surgeries, can I? Can I pay for my soldier, my soldier? Frick! No, I didn't, I did not know that, Austin. I jumped down 14 stairs and my friend recorded and the teacher saw the recording. And he didn't get mad. He said he had respect for doing it, but to not do it ever again. Dude, that'd be me as a teacher. I'd be like, listen, listen. Respect. Don't ever do that thing again. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. The Big Lederf. Did I say your name right? Thank you for jumping in the stream. Thanks for the clip, Chuck. <laughs> Here, watch this clip. Watch this. Gibby's gonna throw that. Lifeline's coming around the back. Throw that right there. I love this clip. Get punched again, idiot! <laughs> <laughs> oh Let's freaking go! <laughs> Dude, so for context, I had punched- if you guys play Apex, I had punched that Gibraltar three times to death. That was the third time in a row that we had rushed that center room in arenas and I had to just shot him a bunch and his final punch. That happened three times. 
Dude, I love that you guys are saying stories in the chat. So story time. After practice one day, we were in the parking lot and my friend drove up to us. So I asked for a ride to my car and like climbed into his window and laid on top of the car. Then he floored it and turned to the right and I went flying off into the air and smacked my shoulder and head onto the concrete. Austin, your friend is an idiot. I can understand flooring it and slowing down slowly, but flooring it and going around a corner? Woke up in the hospital. Woke up in the hospital. Holy frick. With a concussion, fractured skull, broken collarbone, brain bleeding, and nerve damage in my leg. Also, no memory of the incident. Austin, your friend is a moron. I'm sorry. So I somehow cut my thumb with a spoon in class, and the teacher was in disbelief. Still have the nerve damage over four years later. I mean, you're stupid for getting on the car, but like, there's no way that your friend as the driver did that and like didn't consciously think like, I'm going to fling him off the car. Like I've had friends jump on my hood or like the top of my car and you like cruise a little bit. Like it's funny. It's what you do when you first turn 16, you get your license, but flooring it and turning right. That's like, no. Nah. That's stupid. I've jumped on people's roofs before, but it's friends that I knew wouldn't try and put me in the ER. Either consciously or unconsciously. Even if not, us fools gotta stick together. Facts. King Michael that was in here earlier currently has the record time on this track. All right, it is, it is 518. We're on race three. I think we're going to have our final few races. So this will be the final Grand Prix of the stream, and I unfortunately do have to leave. When I get home, I have to clean up this mess of Pokemon cards. And uh, I'm going to try going on eBay and selling some of these cards while they're still hot. Um, and see what we can get for them. And I'll update you, update you guys next stream of uh, what did we make profit-wise or did we lose money? Which I don't think we will. No, sissy, no! The rock was the perfect ramp. Oh, no. Kid wrecked. <laughs> Austin taken first, Chuck taken second, Sarita taken third, Fuhan in fourth, the big Ladurf in fifth, Kiki, Derp on my slurp, me, and Cthulhu rolling on in. I'm sorry, Haley, only one to die. All right, two more, two more races, chat. Dude, this one sucks for Kiki. She gets wrecked every single time. All right, I'll go. Whenever I moved into my first apartment, whenever we would drink, I would turn uh, into... Hold on, sorry. I got to stop my chat from going so fast. Uh, whenever I moved into my first apartment, whenever we would drink, I would turn into a master chef and cook to cure our drunk munchies. Everyone loved it, except the time I was chopping potatoes and sliced off a piece of my thumb. My roomie and I found a random shoestring to help tie around the knuckle to stop the bleeding. And we didn't even get to eat the potatoes. <laughs> Holy frick. Dude, I've never had to pause my chat to be able to have to read things. Alright. Uh, so my friend didn't have a bike. 
So we found a spinny chair and we tied that to my bike and he rode the bike and I rode rode the chair and the rope that we had tied broke and it started going downhill and that moment I jumped off holding the chair so I scraped my knee but the chair hit me so I did that so I did what anyone would. I walked it off and didn't care till tomorrow. Facts. I hope the ghosts are nice today. Yeah, me too. I hope they don't kill you. It's amazing how much me and technology don't get along. Ran into the same issues on PC. Asked to click to authorize. No authorized option to click on and advance it. That's annoying. Marbles is a little bit confusing. It took me a little bit when I was first figuring it out. Too many good stories in here. It feels like group therapy. Yeah, everyone's getting out their trauma of their... Their dumb stories. Dude, I have... I've never broken a bone. I've fractured a bone. Um, never had a cavity. I don't have any intense stories of me f super hurting myself. It's like, I can't... Dude, Chuck is dead. R.I.P. No context. One sentence story. I locked someone in a dumpster overnight once. Overnight? What the frick? Is that why you do the hot sauce? Yeah. So I can come up with stories. I have to find certain things to relate with people on. New channel point. One sentence story. Just, yeah, yeah. Chuck, there you go. Make it cheaper than the full story time. But where you just literally say one sentence like that, and then you you can't elaborate. People will ask questions like, "Whoa, whoa, whoa, this is," and you're like, "Nope." One sentence story, and then you move on. Was it John Cena? <laughs> Dude, that's so funny. <laughs> and if it was, was it because you couldn't see him? Yeah, Chuck didn't know he locked John in there. Austin is dead. Also. R.I.P. The ghosts are hungry. No, it was when I was collecting for the Wanderers in Las Vegas. He owed me money. Solid. So, in my notes, don't piss off Chuck and don't owe Chuck money. One time you pissed in a garbage can? Solid. That'd, that'd be a great out of context clip. One time I pissed in a trash can. Solid. You could piss off Chuck. It's okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm someone who like, and my friends tell me this. It's hard for me to make people mad because I laugh at things and I smile at things. And so like, uh, it was funny. We, we go out to Chili's every Wednesday night after youth group with a few of my friends and some of my friends will start like roasting other person and they'll get like a little triggered and then I'll say something and they don't get mad at me and then my friends are like why don't you get mad at him and obviously they're like I don't know it's just Brendan and so Austin I'm talking about Cass like I can't ever make Cass mad she's just like I don't know I can't get mad at him it's better to be pissed off than pissed on <laughs> yeah yeah. <laughs> I am the reason Tonka toys are plastic now. What? Oh God, this is going to be great. At about age four, I was homesick playing on the Atari. My middle brother got home from school and kicked me until I went away so he could play. I grabbed my steel Tonka dump, tr dump truck and snuck up behind him, hit him in the back of the head, and sat next to his unconscious body playing the Atari again. The emergency room my parents took him to said if he was hit a centimeter lower, it could have killed him. Dude, you were a badass kid. You about have killed your brother because you wanted your turn on the Atari. Tim and Caleb were the only ones I've ever seen piss off Cass. Fair. Cthulhu. That's like the type of thing like you would see in like a like a horror movie. Like the making of like a murderer. Just a brother playing the Atari casually, enjoying his time with a smile on his face, and next to him is just his brother's bloody unconscious body. Holy frick. I 
on. I gotta read, read catch up on chat. That's something I will do no matter what, as I get somewhat bigger on stream. I want to be able to read everyone's chat messages. I respect streamers that do that. So my friend, me and my friend were cool with his teacher and he let us fool around. So one time he choke slammed me into a table and he saw, and the only thing he had to say, what tips to throw. Sorry, I, I didn't understand that one. Uh, so don't piss uh, Chuck off or owe him money and don't take away Cthulhu's Atari. <laughs> we're learning things about each other today. Uh, one time I went swimming 20 minutes after eating. Dude. Chuck, you're a madman. I had two older half-brothers and had to learn to adapt. Yeah, by like making them go unconscious to play the Atari. Also calling you Chuck felt weird. Undo. Undo. <laughs> That's the most dangerous thing I've heard of someone doing. I'm surprised you're still alive, dude. Yeah, I can't believe you did, couldn't even just wait 10 more minutes, dude. You put your whole life at risk. One was four years older, the other was six. Had to learn to scare them into leaving me alone. It worked. Also, why I only have one kid? The local hospital knew me and my brother by name. Bro. <laughs> dude, I just imagine, like, your older brother's friends are coming over and like, Dude, do you think you could tell your little brother? No. No. Dude, I want to play. No. No. Your, your brother's like terrified to do anything around you. They like don't want to talk about it because you're like, don't tell anyone. Then I'd be scared to live in a house with you. Thanks for the bitty, Chuck. Play music, Megalovania. All right. Dude, no one survived. This is this is the music we end the stream with. All right, let's finish this Grand Prix. Yeah, you can't mod out other mods. I'm unstoppable. Third place is Fu on Pi. Second place is Sissy is Beast. And in first place is Haley Page. All right, Haley, VIP coin flip, heads or tails. What do you want, Haley? Heads or tails? Tails. Let's go, Haley! Welcome to the VIP gang. What's good, Cypher? VIP Haley underscore underscore page. There we go. Haley is now in the VIP gang. All right. Who we raiding? Got no one streaming. We're going to go to Marbles. Let's find someone to raid. We got 12 people. Let's find someone with like right, right around here. Kimmy Oopsis? Ooh. I'm not following Kimmy. She's streaming Apex. Epic. Yeah, guys, if you're not jumping for Into Falls Pokey and Cake, whatever. I don't watch them ever. Uh, we're gonna stream our friend Kimmy Oops. She is streaming Apex Legends. Let me uh We're gonna raid a channel. Kimmy Oops. Guys, oh my gosh, I didn't freaking copy it correctly. It's all right. Guys, exclamation point raid. If you are subbed to the channel, copy that message. 
Go give Kimmy a good time. She's a very awesome and sweet streamer. Play on Apex. The raid has been started. Copy that message. Thank you guys again for hanging out. Thank you for Pokemon. Thank you for the end. Thank you for everything. I will see you guys next time. Peace out. You see someone in there? Yeah, they barricaded. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're in there. Oh, oh my god. Raid, let's fucking go. Hello, Brandon Murphy. Thank you for the. You, ju you just got hydrate. Hide it for us. Okay. What? Uh.